of the Raspberry Pi or the Brick Pi, along with the host of sensors that we have. They are basically plug and play, so we spend less time trying to solder things or connect things together and more time actually doing things. I was really the first person in our class to use that and to use any sort of wireless capabilities with our robots. So it was cool being able to not only program it wirelessly, but also when you're running the program, you can send it commands wirelessly. Better capabilities, stronger processor, more inputs and outputs. My name is Andrew Williams. I am a senior in electrical engineering at the University of Tulsa. Douglas Jessam. I'm an applied uh, system professor with the electrical engineering department at the University of Tulsa. My favorite thing about working with the Brick Pi was the, uh, the community, uh, how open it was and how much I've been developed for it already. The use of libraries just makes it easier for us to not have to reinvent everything. I love Python, I've been using it for years and I was able to use that but also, when I had issues with it, I could go to the forums and ask questions and I get responses within, you know, hours or days. So. My name is Tori Weber. I go to the University of Tulsa. I'm an electrical engineering major with a computer science minor. I am Marla Zumo and I am the department admin in electrical and computer engineering at TU. What I liked about it was a system that I could do a lot of prototyping while having to go to the machine shop. That left me to Legos. And the next step was to look around for what else is there that would complement Legos, and that led me to Dexter Industries. I'm really excited to learn how to use the Raspberry Pi. And our professor offered us the opportunity to use the Brick Pi, and I thought it would be a really cool way to not only learn the Raspberry Pi, but also learn robotics in conjunction with that. I feel like the customer service is exceptional beyond beyond most things, and I deal with a lot of vendors, a lot. Uh, using so so far, it's been it's been outstanding. Well, that's a good question because robotics is more than just electrical engineering; it's mechanical engineering, it's computer science. As part of education, is really important because it's a really great way to learn about the interaction of hardware and software, and I think that's really important um, for an electrical engineer or a computer scientist. We have senior tech electives, and one of them was robotics, and one, I liked the professor that was teaching the course, uh, but I was also getting really interested in the field. It's also a good platform because they talk about the next revolution. There's computers, then was the internet, then was smartphones, then social media. Well, robotics is the next big thing. What, you're not going to build your stuff in a bubble. Like it needs to interact, and I think robotics is a really important way of learning that. It's a really cool platform that pretty much anyone can use to learn not only basics but also fundamentals and uh, more advanced techniques for any sort of robotics. I just think it's a really cool way to interact with our world. 